Welcome back to Reality Bites Back, where we serve up the juiciest gossip from the world of 90 Day Fiancé. Today, we're diving into the headline-grabbing news of Nikki Exotica's unconventional solo wedding. Let's dish out all the details and hear what fans have to say about this bold move. Stay tuned for all the drama right here on Reality Bites Back. 90 Day Fiancé fans met Igor Justin Shutenkov and Nicole Sanders, Aka Nikki Exotica in season 10 on TLC. They split in March this year, but now fans think that she married herself. Read on to find out what's going on. Before the 90 day fiance, Star changed her looks with more surgery than even Darcy Silva could wish for. She wasn't exotic at all. Dead named Jason Torres was shy, angry, humiliated, and bullied because of his feminine traits. So changing her looks as much as possible became Nikki's aim in life after her transition. One of the times that Nikki Exotica felt devastated was after Igor claimed that she came across as having man vibes. It came during the tell-all, and he said, When I feel man's vibes, I tell if she learned to behave more like a lady, everything would probably be good between us. But the latest discussion on social media focuses on her when she was in a man's body. On Friday, 90 Day Fiancé Update on Instagram posted some photos of the TLC stars. Two of them showed Igor, and one of them was an old photo of Nikki from before. She transitioned. In the caption, the admin wrote, Nikki Exotica on the right before transitioning. Both pics are Igor on the left exploding head, a post shared by 90 Day Fiancé Reality, TV Eyes Hot, at 90 Day Fiancé Update, TLC fans were amazed because Nikki Exotica looked so similar to Igor. In fact, they felt that she could have been his twin. 90 Day Fiancé alum, Laura Jalali commented, That's crazy. Ends up she's attracted to the man she was a very interesting thinking face. Here are some other comments. According to the New York Post, there's a new dating term to describe people like Nikki Exotica, who feel attracted to someone who looks like them. The outlet explained that it's a play on the word doppelganger and is known as a doppelbanger. The outlet cited a Norwegian study that found people often go for those with familiar features. The findings showed participants distinctly preferred a self-based morph eye, weight, their partner's face with a small amount of self's face blended into it. What are your thoughts about Nikki Exotica marrying someone who looked remarkably like she did before her transition? Shout out in the comments below, and come back here often for all your 90-day fiancé news.